company that now owns the Isle of Home Show is called Media 10. Media 10 uh, bought the Isle of Home Show a year and a half ago. Um, I don't know if you know or not, the Isle of Home has been going for 103 years. And what we decided when we bought the show was to look back at the history. And we found that uh, after the first one, uh, the original Isle of Home Show uh, launched a campaign, uh, Homes for Heroes. In support of the Soul's charity, uh, we decided to uh, try and link um, the charity with, 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 with homes. That's so, right. so we decided to um, build a room set uh, made completely out of reconstructed soldiers' uniforms. Uh, the idea being that we went to army service stores, we went to the soldiers' stores themselves, and we took old uniforms, had them all taken apart, and then, and then rebuilt completely as furnished. How did it, have you got the feedback that you've got back from um, soldiers? Absolutely fantastic. Uh, last year we raised uh, over £120,000 for the charity. This year we're looking to raise uh, a million pounds. And uh, the soldiers that have come here so far today have absolutely loved it. They've, they've never seen anything made from things that they would normally throw away. And what will happen to the um, produce after this event? Will it be auctioned off? Um, will it be put into a competition? Or will it be given to um, victims of um, soldiers being lost in war, for example? Once, we've, once, once the Idle Hunt Show London closes, we put all the furniture and the room set into storage and then we're going to take it to Scotland. We're launching Idle Home Scotland in May. We'll take the whole thing now and, and, and attempt to raise more money for charity.